Nothing's more frustrating than when you can't get to sleep. I'm going to share with you in this video what I do when I can't get to sleep at night. Hi, I'm Jamie Drum from Relaxing Sleep Station and on this channel you'll find videos that are made to help you fall asleep at night. We've got videos on guided meditations, relaxing gratitude journals, soothing sleep music and a number of other video styles such as nature sounds and classical music, all the different things that people have found to help them fall asleep. So in this video, this is part of my, my monthly series that I'm doing at the moment. To, to share with you three things that I'm grateful for every day. And the reason I do this is to help you fall asleep at night by showing you a method that you can use to help calm your mind so that you can sleep. When you've got that racing mind, when you just need to slow your mind down for sleep, one of the things that can be really helpful is just to think back in your day about something that you're grateful for. Not something that you're anxious or worried about, but something that brought you joy through the day. So I want you to join with me as I share three things that I'm grateful for. And you can maybe write in the comments below three things that you're grateful for. And hopefully by watching this video, you'll, you'll get a better understanding of what I'm thinking about when I'm doing my gratitude journal. And, and you can bring that into your own life. And that's really the key. To develop a new journal that you can write in or think about on a daily basis that's going to lead you towards better sleep. So number one for me today was the beautiful sunrise that, that we had this morning. Here in Adelaide, uh, the sun's just starting to come up a little uh, earlier in the day, which means that as I'm leaving for work, the sunrise is just starting to to bloom into full colour and it's it's been really nice the last few days it's starting to get warmer as well which doesn't hurt I'm, I'm quite happy about that too but the thing that really it just stopped me in my tracks as soon as I closed the front door was like wow what a beautiful day and so I, I stopped a couple of times along the way to take a couple of photos and you can see here this video. It was really lovely. Over the lake, there's, um, you can see birds in the foreground. They're just waking up and nibbling on the grass and finding the seeds and, and maybe the, the insects in the grass. And we've also got birds flying in the sky and, and just the most beautiful sunrise, which was just breathtaking. So, and stopping for this meant that I was potentially gonna miss my bus. But it didn't matter. This was one of those moments. This is one of the moments that you just want to stop and, and, and just soak it all in because it's so beautiful. Really, that's what life's all about is enjoying the small, the little moments. And this was a little moment you know, brought to me by Mother Nature. And I just had to soak it all in and just really enjoy it. So number one was definitely, absolutely, the highlight of the day for me today was the most beautiful sunrise. I'd love to maybe hear or see about some of your sunrises. If, if you have a YouTube channel and you'd like to link to it here, I'd love to see it. I'd love to see, maybe it's on your Facebook page or somewhere else. I'd love to see a, a sunrise or a sunset that you witnessed recently. And together, you know, we can just share and enjoy Mother Nature. The second thing I'm grateful for today was um, my Cody box arrived. So I don't know if you know what a Cody box is, but I got one for both me and my mum and they arrived today. So the Cody box, it's a, it's a way to stream um, different TV shows or different um, you know, streaming sites that you can access. It's basically, you know, rather than having a computer or rather than having you know, a whole bunch of um, boxes and computers, you know, DVRs hooked up to your TV. Just a small little box. It's it's maybe just this big and a tiny little keyboard as well. It's really, really tiny. Comes with a remote control as well. And that was 90 Australian dollars. And yeah, I'm always interested in, in new technology and different ways of doing things. And 
I heard some really good things about it and so picked one up. So really excited to see how that goes. If, if anyone's interested and they want to know more about it, um, I can let you know in another video how that goes. Really happy with the purchase, looking forward to getting involved and, and we'll see how it goes. So I guess this, this particular gratitude that I have here sort of shows you that you can really be grateful for anything. It doesn't always have to be the you know really deep and meaningful stuff. Sometimes it can just be, you know, a really simple gift that you give to yourself. Something that you've been looking forward to, that you've enjoyed. And, and you don't have to, you know, feel bad about enjoying getting something, you know, like a, um, something you bought online. That's definitely something you can be grateful for. Maybe it's the, the fact that you are financially in a position that you were able to purchase something for yourself. So gratitude and money and buying things you know they're not exclusive from each other so i think that's a really good example of i'm grateful for the, the fact that i get the opportunity to spend money on something like this you know i'm i'm living in a country where you know i've i've got the opportunity to have a job and i can work and, and make money and provide for me and tia and i'm really grateful for all of those things so and it manifests at the moment in, in this device that I'm really interested in looking into. So that's number two for me. And number three, the third thing I'm grateful for today is it's the weekend now coming up, which, you know, I, I love every day. I'm, I'm always excited for every day, not just when the weekend comes. But this weekend is kind of special because Sunday is Father's Day. I'm really looking forward to seeing my dad. And tomorrow I'm going to go around with Tia and see my mum as well. Um, so my parents are divorced and this is a great opportunity to see them both on the same weekend. Usually we go and see my mum one weekend, my dad the next. Purchased one of those Cody boxes for my mum. So it'd be a good opportunity just to try and set that up for her. And you know, mum and, and Tia are going to go looking at tiles for a bathroom. So they'll, they'll really enjoy that. And together, you know, we'll, we'll have a great time. And then on Sunday, we'll go see my dad for Father's Day. Every, every moment that I get to spend with him is an absolute blessing. I really enjoy getting to see him. I'm really looking forward to that as well. He's, he's a treasure in my life. You know, we, we often talk about the deep and meaningful things. And, you know, he definitely fits the bill there. He, he's been a mentor to me, someone that I've really looked up to my whole life. Now I'm in a position where I can help him. You know, he he needs care, he needs help and assistance, and I'm really proud to be in a position to do that. So that's definitely, you know, a big highlight. It's, his, it's Father's Day on Sunday and a great opportunity to continue to show my love and support and care and, and thoughtfulness for, for my dad. So love you, Dad. Looking forward to seeing you on Sunday. So that's my three things. I'd really love to hear about what your three things are in the comments. Leave, leave your three gratitudes, things that you're grateful for. And remember, if you're having trouble falling asleep, just think about your day and the three things that you're grateful for. You don't have to look forward and worry about what's happening the next day or you know, worry about the negative things that maybe happened today. But just concentrate on what were three things that you were really grateful for today that were just you know, things that were special about this day that you can share with me and with others here on the channel. So remember, you can subscribe as if, if this is your first time here. Check out all of the rest of our catalogue. If you're looking for sleep videos, if you're looking for guided meditations, sleep music or classical music, whatever it is that you need, you'll be able to find it here. So have a look for those. And until I speak to you next time, much love and we'll see you soon.